HD News at 10. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Amelia Serling. It's a religion often in the headlines and one some people say is misrepresented, but local churches and a local mosque have been coming together to increase understanding about Islam. Kelly Schlicht was there as people of both faiths found common ground. Here in this church, this interfaith group is learning all about Islam. That God has sent uh, the same religion to Adam and Noah and Abraham and Jacob and uh, Solomon, David, and then Buddhists and Jesus and Muhammad. And Muhammad is one of the prophets who God sent over the millennia. Many Christians in attendance say they're surprised by what they're learning of Islamic culture. They had academic achievement more than our own renaissance, which really floored me. The two places, in Spain and in Baghdad. Panelists say the more Christians that learn about Islam can lead to greater tolerance in the community. Through understanding, we can really figure out what it's all about, you know, and uh, get away all this mis away from all this misunderstanding and all these terrorists and so forth. They are not representative. I think the most important thing is that if we have this understanding, then there will be less conflict. And those who came say they hope understanding extends beyond these sessions and out into the world. In Eau Claire, Kelly Schlicht, WEAU 13 News. The third and last session of the Understanding Islam series will be held next Saturday, November 13th at First Lutheran Church in Eau Claire. It will focus on growing up Muslim in America and feature student speakers from UW-Eau Claire.